In this video, we're going to show you just how simple and fast it is to find the parts that you need right from your computer using Online Parts Counter. The best part is there is no software to install, no hardware to purchase, no complicated manuals to read, and no messy computer integration issues. You can keep your mind on business, not technology. It doesn't get any simpler than this. To begin, go to allstatepeterbilt.com. Now click on the Online Parts Counter link in the top right corner. You will enter the username and password that has been provided to you. Upon first login, you will be asked to enter an email address or mobile phone number. Next, you will be asked to complete your profile. Here you will enter general information about yourself and your company. The next screen will allow you to enter a contact name and give you the option to change your password. You will then be prompted to read and accept the end user license agreement. Once you've entered your information, you will have the opportunity to set up a loyalty card that will give you monthly and yearly discounts on select items. If you already have a loyalty card, you can search for it here by either name, phone number, or business name. Linking your loyalty card will ensure that you never miss out on one of our great specials on parts by automatically applying the available discounts when you order a part. Now that you are all set up, it's time to search for and order some parts. The available catalogs are a great search tool. The TRP catalog contains pictures and descriptions for those hard to find cross references. You can see pricing, pictures, and loyalty card offers. When you find the part you're looking for, you can easily add it to your cart. You can access part manuals for your fleet by selecting Fleet eCAT. You will need to contact your branch for additional login access and to set up your fleet. Convenient vendor catalogs are also available. You can choose from the list of vendors on the left-hand side of the screen. When you choose the vendor that you would like to search in, you can narrow down your search to a specific part. After finding the part that you need, you can use the stock check screen to find the part. Simply click the stock check tab at the top, type in the part number that you want, the quantity that you need, and then click stock check. It will display your price, your default branch location, and how many they have in stock. If your default location does not have the inventory you need, you can select the drop down on the right hand side to see all other locations and how many they have on hand. Items eligible for loyalty offers will also be displayed as an image of a loyalty card next to your price. If you hover over the image, it will display the loyalty card offer. The price for each displayed here is before the loyalty card discount. To add this item to your cart, click the add to order button. You will notice that your cart in the upper right hand corner has been updated and you remain on the stock check screen. If you know the part number that you need but would like to see if there are any alternatives, you can select cross reference from the stock check screen or by selecting cross reference from the tools tab. Type in the part number that you want and click search. Select the brand that you want to search against. The available options will be displayed below. Once you locate the part you want, you can select the quantity you want to order and add it to your cart. If your order is complete, you can click on the cart to proceed to checkout. On this screen, you will have the opportunity to enter your purchase order number if needed. Next, select a delivery method. Now you can review your order. The price on this screen will show the actual price with the loyalty discount, the extended price of your order, and your total savings. If there are any special instructions for your order, you can enter them in the order comments box and they will be printed on your order at the branch and on your invoice. To finalize your order, simply click Place Order on the right hand side of the screen. The last feature we will cover is viewing your order history. Click on Order History at the top 
and it will bring you to your pending orders. It will display all pending orders. If you need to reference an order that has been invoiced, you can change the order type to Invoiced Orders. Locate the order in question and click on the order number to display the invoice. This covers the basics on how to utilize Online Parts Counter. If you would like to learn more about what Online Parts Counter can do for you, simply contact your branch. We hope this has been helpful and we know that Online Parts Counter is going to improve the way that you can do business.